Hi everyone, welcome to another iPhone app review. Today we're going to take a look at a game called Chopper. Now previously we had taken a look at Apache Lander, which was the first helicopter-based game for the iPhone. And uh, Apache Lander and Chopper couldn't be more different. So here's the idea behind the game. Let's go ahead and start a new game so you can get a sense of how this works here. Go a new game. And first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to check the normal level. We'll get back to why that's important in a little bit. So essentially, you're operating this helicopter. You do so with the accelerometer. And up here on the right-hand side, that's your gun. That gentleman there on top of the building is actually a good guy. You can tell by the, uh, the green around him. So you land your chopper. And the idea here is you want to pick up these uh, various people and bring them back to the base and unload them from the helicopter. Now, here's the thing about this. Chopper, at least on the normal level, is really pretty tedious and uh, pretty boring as well. But if you go in and change the level to harder, you might actually find that uh, the game, well, you will find, the game is far more engaging and perhaps more of what you expected. So let's take a look at the harder version of that same level. You'll notice already I got people shooting at me on top of this building. Oh, and I crashed my helicopter. Now, after playing Chopper for a little while, I was getting pretty frustrated and didn't really uh, care for the game. And then I realized, you know what? I've been playing this thing for half an hour and kept playing and playing and playing. It's a very addictive game. However, at $7.99, it is a bit overpriced. The sound effects become monotonous. Some of the explosions are great, but uh, sound good. But whenever your Chopper blows up, sounds more like someone uh, coughed rather than some sort of helicopter blow up or anything. Plus, there's no actual soundtrack to the game. And these are some of the things you might expect in a game that's going to run $7.99, which is on the higher end of the spectrum for an iPhone or iPod Touch game. Maybe something around $3.99 would be a, uh, a great price for this game. But as it is, it's, uh, it's a little pricey for what it is. But still, very, very addictive once you start to play Chopper. One other note about this game, there are some levels that take place at uh, night, in night scenes, and those are very difficult to see if you're playing outside during the day. In sunlight, very difficult to see the game screen. So it's a very addictive game, a little overpriced, and could use a little bit more polishing for the price, including a soundtrack. But uh, that's our look at Chopper for the iPhone and iPod Touch. For the TV. I'm Ryan Ritchie.